Sit. Sit. Marker. Tell me more about the dogs. Oh, they're sweethearts. Let me tell you about our lethal duo of Dave and Carol, our Rottweilers. I got a little confused for a second there. Why? Because they have names? Those are people's names. Oh, not in this case. Dave and Carol, I just love those names, first of all. And not only is it terrific working with the dogs, but you gotta give the credit to Sarah Clifford, who is the dog trainer. The actors, myself uh, in this case, uh, needs more training than the dogs as far as what's needed in the scene. But we work together and um, we have a good time. I mean, these dogs are so, so sweet. My name is Sarah Clifford. I'm the animal coordinator and I'm in charge of all the dogs. I adopted the dogs. I had to find the dogs. They live with me. Slobbered on. Sorry. They're not allowed to be in here. Only service animals. Warming my feet's not a service. When I read the pilot, I remember the guy said, what's your biggest concern? And I said, honestly, the dogs. The fact that Dan Chase had two dogs and very specific actions, I knew that this was going to be a really big deal. In real life, I'm a huge dog person. I sleep with my dogs, I love my dogs, I kiss my dogs on their little shaggy lips, you know. But I did think like, oh, it would be great if Zoe was not a dog person. <laughs> but We decided upon Rottweilers really because of their strength, their loyalty, their look. You know, a lot of people are intimidated by Rottweilers, but they're also, you know, could be very gentle dogs. Jeff was so connected to them, and you just feel it in every frame. Dave and Carol are Dan's friends, and just when we think that they're adorable, we also realize that they have a lethal quality, and they are his protectors. <laughs> And they're badass Rottweilers, trust me, I know I had to fight them. When I saw Kane, I said, I'm not fighting no dog named Kane, and, uh, and that dog's crazy. We like to have four dogs to be able to interchange them. We have two females, and we have two male dogs. They all have their strengths and weaknesses. A character scene with Chase, typically we actually, and this is a little cinema secret, we use both the girls for that. We just switch the collars around. And the reason is, is because the girls are calm, they're focused, they have a really nice bond with Jeff Bridges. And the boys are a little more on the boisterous side, so when we use the boys, we do them for like the stunt scenes. We use the boys for the running shots, the barking shots, anything that involves action shots. Some of it is Jeff process of wanting anything that happens in front of a camera to feel true. And I think right from the beginning, there was a feeling you can't meet these dogs on camera and convince anybody that you live with them and have for years and years. We'll find another place to lay low. <sighs> I love dogs, and my wife, uh, she's visiting here at the set today, not to see me, but to see the dogs, man, the, the <laughs> Rottweilers. The dogs will really appeal to our viewers because mm. oh. they're wonderful characters, oh. and Rottweilers weren't a breed that were on my radar, but they're amazing. And action. Hey. <laughs> <laughs>